Last time on Chrono Trigger, we finally launched a successful assault on the Ocean Palace. Unfortunately, in the process, Plump gave his life for his friends so that they could continue the fight. They've escaped, also with the help of Shala, and now are on the surface of the planet after it has been drastically changed by a massive tidal wave because Zill fell from the sky. Uh, but let's see what we have around here. A new buy? Maybe. What are you selling? Do you have any tissues for tears to dry our eyes with here? <gasps> Check back with him because his wares vary from time to time. That's good to know. How do I get behind him, though? Hmm. Maybe I can't get behind him yet? I want shiny thing that you hide behind you. Why you no move? Oh well. He might move at some point, who knows. What do we got here? A few enlightened ones did survive, but no distinctions remain between the enlightened and the earthbound anymore. So what, did they lose their power when Zeal fell? A moonstone left in a sunlit spot for millennia becomes a sunstone. The sunkeep of Zeal had such a stone. Very old stones are required to harvest useful amounts of power, though. Maybe we can find that place. Hmm. I wonder, is this anything? The North Cape? Can't get to our epoch. Dang it, maybe we have to go through here yet? We'll check out the North Cape soon. Hello, you. How can I survive in this land without my magic? You don't need magic to survive. Besides, you're not alone. You're absolutely right. We're alive, and together there's always hope. Gotta seize the day. Broken hearts are for assholes. We grew too dependent on a dangerous force, and look what it did to us. Everything and everyone sank to the bottom. The sea of clouds has parted, and the blizzard has finally abated. Could the long winter finally be over? All it took was the destruction of Zeal. Let him sleep. Must have cried himself to sleep. Let's just let him be. It'd be pretty traumatic for a child watching all this destruction. All rested up? Bow and pay homage to our new liege, King Dalton. What? What? That scumbag's still alive? Whoa. Getting feisty there, huh? Strike a pose. You there! What's wrong? You're lucky to be alive. The old crone and the pesky gurus are gone, though. I now rename Zill <laughs> the Kingdom of Dalton. <laughs> you, though, you're alive. Ah, that vehicle outside must be yours. It's just like the one Balthazar was building. I've decided you don't deserve such a splendid toy. Henceforth, it shall be my personal chariot. Hey, you can't do that. You'll have to come with me. You might start a rebellion or something. And now, as a token of my esteem for you, take this. Bonk. What? Urgh. Huh. Cute. How's this? <laughs> Enjoy a little taste of my true power. And with Plump gone, you don't stand a chance. Great. Ugh. Where are we? Did some part of Zill survive? Where this? Hey, Dion. The equipment hath van hath evanesced. All stuff gone. Even the money, that low-down, good-for-nothing... Tina fight. Get all weapons back. Destroy bad man. The good thing is, because we have Tina here, she doesn't need weapons. The new king. Did he really take absolutely... Holy shit, he did. He took everything. 
Hmm. Is this a something that can switch or press? Serves them right. Without weapons, they're powerless. Okay, well, what about this ladder? Whoa. Sky. Sky. This sky. So this is how Dalton survived. The Blackbird. Amazing. He must have evacuated to it and then fled right as everything was going to shit. Hmm. Breeze, come in here. Good senses, Tina. Let us watch our captors from here. Can we? We can. Okay, so they've got guard frog-looking things. No offense, Dion, but we're going to have to kill them. And robots, too. I wonder... Wow, there's a lot of them down there. What are they guarding in that room? Dude, does every room have a guard? That one does. This place, yeah. Oh, this is not going to be easy. Everybody, we all have magic. I guess that's the one thing we have going for us. Do we still have our magic? The enlightened ones lost theirs. But what about us? Can I go down? Hmm. I don't even know where to start. Looks like there's a couple one-way paths, too. We're going to have to be careful. Not sure if we can turn back once we actually step on those conveyor belts. Well, here's the way down. Let's take on this robot. A basher and a bite. At the very least, Tina will be able to rip and tear. Yeah. Not bad. Okay. This could be fairly difficult if we can't find a way to heal, either. But again, she is extremely amazing. She doesn't need a weapon. Her fists are weapons. Does this do anything? Yeah, it does. Hey, you! No, hey, you! Rip and tear. So I guess they're not frog-looking dudes. They do just have a Casey Jones hockey mask on. From that angle, though, it looks like they have frog eyes. Hard to tell their faces bent down. Okay, so what do we have? Actually, wait. That's where we came from. The robots respawn. Great. Oh, hi, guys. <laughs> We're just, uh, stopping in. Paige and Dion don't get to act at all? Really? I thought for sure they would at least be able to use their tech abilities, but I guess not. Well then. Thank you very much. I would not be able to do this without her. If you don't have Tina, I think you have to be really stealthy, but... Yes, we got all of our items back already. Amazing. I don't know how you would do this without her. Okay, comment arrow, memory cap, give it the blue mail, why not? And where is her other ring? Where is it? Um, isn't it like this? Don't tell me it. Did he steal that? Didn't she have like a silver ring or something? Am I just imagining this? Mm. You know what I guess? Give her the green dream. That kind of sucks. 
I don't think we've gotten all of our items back yet. Her speed is already just about to be maxed out, so... Give her the... Give her the charm top. We'll be charming the pants off of everything in here. Yeah, we don't have all of the items, okay. I hope we get all of them back. I'll be kind of sad if we don't. You take the dash ring. And... Okay, we got all of these items back, at least. This won't be so tough now. But again, yes, um, if you don't have Tina in your party, I believe it's a lot more difficult. You have to sneak through here. Or not. Still missing stuff. Let's go back. I cannot afford to lose all of those items. Hey, you. Hey, you! No, I said, hey, you, first. P.U. This is for Plump. Rip his liver out and feed it to him. Hey, we learned Slurp Kiss and Bubble Hit. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna con we're gonna check out all of these rooms. Hey, you! Oh, really? Everybody wants some? Um, first, I want to see what we can charm off of these guys. We'll charm and Dion will kill. Oh. oh, these guys are always broke. It is required that you give an offering of contrition to the ladies here. If you don't, Dion will cut you like a knife. Cut you with a knife, too. Um, let's steal from him, then. Considering the fact he's the only one left. Aww. I wouldn't be surprised if all of Dalton's lackeys are broke. Complete stooges. And scrooges. Okay. What else do we have? Um... Yeah, I feel kind of bad about cheesing this part. I mean, it's not really cheesing, but this part is so much more difficult if you don't have Tina. It is ridiculous how difficult it is. You actually have to use that trick of looking down through the vents and following the guards and kind of learning their routes, I think. Oh, well. Are these more of our items? Tina's equipment is back, yes. Okay, so apparently that first chest that we got just gave us all of the items that we didn't have equipped at the time. Aha, uh -huh, there's her silver earring. Looks like it also automatically equipped her with it. Man, I'm gonna keep the charm top on her, even though that would give her almost maximum hit points, that ring would. You know what? Kill him. Hey, you! Yeah. Um, here we go. Could you quit tickling us with those missiles, please? We're just here to have fun. Those guys are worthless. How dare you, knave! How about, come on, one, one item for the road. That's all we, that's all we want. That's all we request. Dang it. These monsters are just not that good. Okay. What do we have in here? Uh, you know what? Might as well save it. Seems how we've done a little bit of stuff. We still don't have our gold back. That sucks. Gold in here? Hey, what are you guys doing? Hey, you! No, you! Are you guys trying to div divvy up our stuff here? Is that what's going on? You better not be sorting through the ladies' clothing, you sickos.
This isn't Japan. It's not acceptable. Yay, our money back. Yeah, Steve, if you... What is this? Is there anything up here? Let's jump. Go skydiving. Um, what about down here? Knock, knock. Uh, sorry to interrupt the party. Frog? Good lord. Leap slash, no. Bubble hit. No, just use... No, use the Dino Tail on all of them. And Ice, too. I don't want to waste my time attacking individually here. There's a dinosaur on the ship! Run for your lives! Dalton didn't say anything about dinosaurs. Yay, Paige! And Tina level up and Dion learns water, too. Glacier! Delicious. Wonderful. What do we have up here? Okay, another entrance to the vents. That... There's probably a secret room in the vents that can only be accessed that way, but I don't... I don't know if I'm gonna spend a lot of time looking for it. Only two of you? Sucks to be you guys. Bashers. Apparently one of the most worthless enemies in the game. All talk and no show. They're threatening, but that's it. Yay! Keep dancing, Dion. Let's see. Got the demon hit back, the time hat, the red mail, and the power scarf. However... Hmm. Eh, hell, we'll leave the power scarf on. It's not a big deal. Oh, wonderful. Why are you calling the alarm for? There's no one coming to help you. So, what is the next stop? We still don't have... Pages equipment, I think. Maybe it's in here. Maybe not. Um, I've already checked in here. Okay. I don't know why these conveyor belts are here. Considering the fact they placed the controls right there for them. Hey, wait. It's back through here. Did I already come through? Yeah, I did. Pretty sure we've already been through there. What about in here? Already been through there. Excuse us. Oh, you guys must be guarding something important. No, hey you. Good job, Dion. You sure you didn't want to lick him though? Is there anything in here? Maybe some switches we can throw? Crash this blackbird? Yeah, I'm not gonna wander around up in the vents. Unless I absolutely have to. Hey, you! We said it first! Delicious criticals, but still nowhere even close to being as powerful as Plump was. That's going to be a hard loss to get over. What about here? Hmm, I am missing a room somewhere. Let's see, what do we have here? Nothing. I'm going to check a few of these things. What's that? Aha, a magic tab. Um, how about we use that on Paige? I guess now that Plump's gone, we can get back to boosting her stats a little bit. Let's see. There has to be a room. 
with pages of stuff in it. There just has to be. Aha. Uh -huh. Is this a secret room? Looks like it is. Ah, uh, yeah. Wake this guy up. What are you doing sleeping in here with Paige's gear? I don't even want to know. Okay. So yeah, that, I think, was the only room that's only accessible by the vents. I could be wrong. I'm sure I am. Again, I don't remember all the secrets in this game. I'm sure there's other LPs out there that will have no problem showing you absolutely everything. But this LP is not one of them. I think that's all we need here. I got the hiccups. That means we're good to go. Question is, where are we going? Round and round and in circles. Okay. Just, yeah, just stay there and float. Look all happy. I think we need to go through here. Here we go. Probably gonna die. Whoa. I think I can get blown off the edge, actually. It's slowly blowing us back. I don't remember what happens if we fall off. I think we die. Maybe. What the hell? Am I supposed to fight these things, or what? Um, you know what? Let's fight one of them. A turret. Oh, really? Well, that's fine. I didn't want to use any of my abilities anyways. We can crush you just the same, bonk. Say, so maybe I have to destroy all the turrets on the wing? I think we do. We're gonna find out. Bonk? Somebody hit this thing? Oh, great. Hmm. Did I even get any experience for that? Don't think we did. Okay. Yep, you're gonna lock us out. That's fine. That's fine. Can't even use any items, that's harsh. Get a critical attack. Get a critical bonk. Or not. Pew, pew. At least they don't hit for that much damage. Because this could take the rest of the video. Maybe we can only hit them... never mind. Maybe we can only hit them when they're blue? I don't think that's how it works. But whatever. Maybe... Maybe I don't get any experience if they self-destruct. Can I fight all three of them? No. So I just make this easy on ourselves. Because it seems like when one self-destructs, they both will. Come on. Finish one of these things before it blows up. Maybe you can't. Have I even hit these things more than once or twice? There's twice. Now what's it going to do? Self-destruct? No. Well, there's three times. Finally killed one. Okay. Wow, a hundred tech points? Ah. I want to kill all of these things. 
please don't self-destruct on us. Think of all the tech points that I'm missing. We could have had Tina's ultimate attack learned by now. Through these things. You guys really gotta start focusing. I know we're on a moving plane. But still. You're heroes, don't lose your cool. I had to check the tech abilities just for a second. Oh well. Nothing I can really do about that, I guess. Hmm. So there's nothing else to do out here? Yeah, I'm not sure what happens if we get blown off, and I'm not going to find out. So that is a dead end. Question is now... Where do we go? It might not be a dead end. I might need to get blown off. So, let's find out. Where's my save point at? Right here? No? We're gonna save it, and then we're gonna go jump off the plane here. Probably die. Yeah. And if that doesn't work, then... I guess we'll just continue exploring, because I'm obviously missing something. Next stop? Oblivion. Okay, here we go. What, I can't be blown off the edge? I was worried about nothing. Quick, jam the engines. What? Okay. Game paused for just a second there. What do we have? Hmm. Something cometh. What's going on? No. Another golem? The golem boss. What is it doing out here? Um, no. Let's see. How about ice attack on it? Just use magic attacks. And... Tina, you just heal people. Wonderful. Another one of these things. The only thing is, it's not saying that it's copying our physics. Okay. Oh great, it's counting down. That's even worse. Bubble hit. Yeah, do that. I want to see what this spell does anyways. Dion, you so crazy. That's not too bad. Um, okay, you start hasting. I have a feeling that we're probably going to die on this boss. I mean, it's just a, a small guess here. Let's try... Quickly Twin Charm on it. See if it has anything worth stealing, and then I'll get back to hasting. No. The boss is broke. Dion... Um, you heal everyone. That'll top us all off, I believe. go and okay haste on Dion mm. what do you mean I can't use tailspin why not Ooh, that was nice heal us again and Tina, a haste for you coming up. I'm kind of scared about what this boss is going to have in store for us. Well, cube toss him. And a leap slash, just because. Have a glacier, you jerk. That's delicious. 
Cyrus guide my blade? Um... Um... What? Did he, did he... Did the boss forget what to do whenever he counts to one? I will accept that. It is made by Dalton, after all, so we can't expect too much out of it. <clears throat> Give him hell, then, gang! You know what, I'm gonna try one more time for a twin charm. Because this guy has to have something. Come on, he's a boss. Nope. Okay, so what happens when he counts down to zero for the second time? Maybe he'll remember? I'd really rather not find out. Glacier, a massive ice attack. We'll try that next. If he still lives. Okay. Where is it? No, I want... Glacier. There we go. And Tina. I don't know why I can't do Tail Spin. I can use Dino Tail. I wonder. Stone an enemy. That's pretty good, too. Yay! The most worthless boss in the whole game so far. Page levels up. Tina, don't give up! <laughs> it's complete. I've done it. What? He added wings to it? See these beautiful wings? Now this is a king's throne. I now name it... The Arrow Dalton Imperial! What? What type of name is that? And they're gonna be my first victims. Arrow Dalton Imperial Engage! No, 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 no! Stop the music! That's their music. Ha ha ha, there we go. That's more like it. Are you ready for takeoff? So what's he gonna do? Is he does he is he actually gonna time travel and try to erase us? The Aero Dalton Imperial. We have liftoff. Houston, I mean Zill. <gasps> Did you see that? Look! Dalton Tannen, what's he doing? Epox. It's flying? It's just crazy. It's not Epoch, you fools! It's the Arrow Dalton Imperial! Get it right. <laughs> and you are now excess baggage. Make like the wind and blow out of here. It's not how the saying goes, Tannen. <laughs> you were like insects to me. Epoch, go now! It's all your fault! Plump. Give him back to us! Damn, Paige. You! Dalton Plus, huh? Okay, um, first up... I guess these guys could try a bubble hit. I probably shouldn't have wasted all of my magic points on that last fight. Sploosh! That was not very good. Could have been a lot better. It's basically what I'm trying to say. Okay. Another haste for you, good sir Dion. I hope you don't mind aging twice as fast, but it's for a good cause. Um I still can't use tailspin. 
here. Give Dion a little kiss. He's looking a bit down over there. And Glacier him. Unfortunately, with that kiss, Dion did not turn back into a human. But maybe that's just because Tina's not a princess. Even though she is a chieftain. Or a chief, anyways. Oh, really? Okay. I don't think he's that big of a threat. Or is he? No. Uh, is this guy serious? Go Golem Boss! Uh, hey Dalton? Yeah, we, uh, your boss is fired. No! Well, that was easier than I thought it would be. Tina levels up, Dion levels up. Nice. So, um... <laughs> that grounding... That groundling thief... Epoch okay? Epoch steer okay. Uh, does anyone know how to fly this thing? Paige, me think it, me thinketh tis the Y button. Okay. I it's not the Y button, Dion. I think you should just stay away from machines. You don't know what you're talking about. Welp. Well, how about the X button? Okay, let's try that. Um... We didn't do it! It wasn't us! Yeah! Justice! Dalton got what he deserved! Whoa! That ship can fly! Amazing. Fantastic. We are actually in his debt. Believe it or not. Epoch in good shape. Epoch, become bird. But what about Plump? If only he were here to see this. That poor lad. Plump strong. Plump won't die. So the Epoch is now... An airship that can time travel. How amazing is that? Plump's gotta be somewhere. I'll find him. It's the last thing I do. So let's see what the villagers have to say. Also, first up, let's use a shelter. There we go. We're running a bit low. Save it and... We're going someplace else after this. He's got more goods. Oh, really? Wow, a star sword, a sonic arrow, a shockwave, kaiser arm, rune blade, hurricane, more Aeon suits for everyone. You can also buy mid ethers now, that'd be great. If they weren't so bloody expensive. Come again. Let me back there. Well, maybe someday. Hello, ma'am. A few enlightened ones did survive, but they don't have any other powers. It's probably for the best. They can learn what it's like to be a real human now. This mysterious sapling. Maybe someday it will help change our environment? Where did you get it from? Gotta seize the day. Gee, seeing you guys has really made my day. Hey, it's Janice's cat. I saw a suspicious looking person up north on the cape. Here, kitty kitty. Meow. A moonstone left in a sunlit spot for millennia becomes a sunstone. Yeah, if only we could find it. A stranger trying to locate someone passed by after you left. Oh, really? No one had ever seen the person who came looking for you. Could he be a friend of yours? Where did he go? We're slowly recovering. We've got to start from scratch. Glad to see you've all recovered. Hooray! 
Stay strong, survivors. We depend on it. Okay, so next stop is this place. Let's save it first. Hmm, what is this? What is it? You. So, it's you. Magus. Behold, everything's at the bottom of the sea. Gone is the magical kingdom of Zeal, and all the dreams and ambitions of its people. I once lived there, but I was another person then. Hmm. A dimensional warp. This power is beyond human control. No! We'll be dragged into the warp. Shala! No, Janice! Stay away! But, but. It's a. Ah. A time gate. No. Shala. Big sis, help. Janice. Our China. What? The this is Hey. There's nothing here. This must be the end of time. What? It's Ozzy. So, thou art, thou art that filthy urchin. Hmm. Ever since Lavos's time portal stranded me in the Middle Ages, I have waited to even the score with it. You interrupted me just when I had summoned Lavos to my castle. How ironic that having been drawn into yet another portal, I would end up in this age. Being from the future, my knowledge of the past enabled me to convince the queen that I was a mighty oracle. But fate... Fate is a fickle mistress. But no history book could have prepared me for what happened here. Unimaginable is the power of Lavos. Anyone who dares oppose it meets certain doom. At this rate, you too will meet a hideous fate. Just like that poor fool Plump. You dare to insult him? He's history. Play with fire and you get burned. Magus, hold thy tongue. You wish to fight me? Now, um... I actually don't wish to fight Magus. You can fight him if you want. However, I am not going to. <laughs> no. I am not. I don't blame you for your actions, Magus. Vanquishing thee will neither return Plump nor Cyrus. You had your reasons for doing what you did. Hmm. Wait. I'll come with you. Treachery! We can't trust you. You know, there just might be a way to bring him back. Nonsense, you're teasing us. Gasper, the guru of time, knows how to restore lost or misplaced time streams. Oh, really? So, we have a new party member now. Magus. Um, let's see... 
I don't think that this name will fit. I might have to butcher it a little bit. We're going to call him Grimms. That's who he is. He's Grimmeth. Shortened it to Grimms. So, welcome to the party, Grimms. I'm not actually going to bring him onto the team just yet. But there he is. If you fight him, you can kill him. If you really think he needs to pay for the crimes that he's committed. Um, I've only done that once because, honestly, I, I kind of feel bad for the guy. I mean... Think about the life and childhood that he's had. Everything that he's done has basically been to kill Lavos. Yeah, he went about it kind of in a horrible way in the Middle Ages by starting a war simply to keep people out of his hair so that he could summon Lavos. But ultimately, he is on our side, and if he has knowledge about how to revive Plump, um, yeah, we're on the time egg. If he can help us, then... I say take all the help we can get. So, whenever we come back, uh, the Epoch can fly. We're free to go wherever we want now. Uh, I think, however, that we're going to go to the end of time and speak to Gaspar and see what he can tell us. Maybe, just maybe, we can bring Plump back, provided Magus wasn't toying with us.